Hey guys, I want to say thank you for visiting our website. It was a pleasure meeting you guys. Um, if you were suffering from mid-back or lower back pain, these are going to be the three stretches that we are going to have you do on a daily basis during phase one of care. The first one that we are going to go over is McKenzie's exercise and Ms. Danae is going to help demonstrate that for you. Uh, she is going to lay face down on the ground um, in this position here. This is going to be her starting position. Uh, from this position here, she's going to bring the arms up, slide up underneath her elbows, and push herself up here. She's not taking the pelvis off of the floor. She's acting as if the pelvis is glued to the floor here so we get maximum pressure pushing into the disc back into the middle uh, where we want it. Uh, from here, if she is comfortable, she will push up with her arms to about this level here, and she can have a slight bend in the arms here. Uh, she's gonna hold this position for a minute. I do recommend that you start on the elbows though at first, holding that for a minute, and then you can progress to the arms going up if you, if you feel comfortable and you're not having any pain. Um, if you have a little bit of discomfort in the low back, that's normal, but we don't wanna have shooting pain into the leg. Uh, from here she's going to hold this for a minute and then she's going to go back to the position that she started from and she's going to hold that for 30 seconds. She's going to come back up, same position underneath the elbows and hold that again for a minute. Once she's done with the minute here she's going to go back down to her starting position and she will conduct this five times. The second uh, stretch that we're going to go over for the mid to low back is going to be the piriformis stretch and the piriformis stretch is going to be deep into the buttocks which can cause some pain in the low back into the sacrum area or sciatica which is a shooting pain into the legs. Ms. Danae here is going to cross her leg. Uh, she is going to reach through and grab into the hamstring and apply the pressure this way. Whenever she pulls she's going to hold this for 30 seconds. Whenever her time is up on the 30 seconds, she's gonna relax and bring both legs down and both feet to the ground. And we always wanna do this stretch on both sides. If you have trouble reaching through the leg, and, and sometimes we see this, um, I'm gonna demonstrate here, you can always wrap a towel in between the hamstring here, and she would grab the towel and pull to assist her in stretching the piriformis. The third and final stretch that you're gonna have for the mid to low back is going to be the psoas stretch. And this one is super important to do if you have low back pain um, or if you're sitting at a desk all day, uh, the psoas tends to get short and it pulls down onto the, the low back. Um, psoas attaches into the lumbar spine and comes down into the hip. And Ms. Danae is gonna show us how to stretch that here. So she is actively going to stretch the right side if she has the left, the left leg forward. She's going to lunge into it, take the chest, lean back, and come over with the opposite arm. Whenever she does this, she's gonna hold this for 10 seconds, and we're gonna do this stretch five times. Whenever she's done with the 10 seconds, she's gonna come back, drop the arm, and then go back into the position with the arm up, lunge into it, lean back, arm over. Thank you guys for taking the time to check out these stretches for the mid-back, low-back, and we'll see you guys soon.